I haven't done a hair tutorial actually in a while so I decided to do this fun hair tutorial just for you by the way it takes about three hours it is so long and I didn't actually realize how long it will be so I will advise you if you want to do this hair tutorial leave yourself space over time because otherwise it will take you forever but I actually love this hair and it's kind of like mermaid inspired uh, in other words lion hair kind of thing because as you can see it's kind of liony which is amazing especially for you girls out there that have kind of flat hair my hair is quite flat usually and it's quite long so I try to make it quite big and bushy but anyway I'm not gonna bore you anymore if you want to see how I achieve this hairstyle then let's begin so the first step that you will be doing is obviously creating these flats all over your hair I did mine quite thick but still not very thick I mean the thinner you do them the better but because my hair is long and thick I did mine a little bit thicker otherwise I'll be sitting there for like 24 hours doing these and actually this took me about an hour and a half so far I still have about two to go that I wanted to show you so before I did the plaits I actually applied a heat protectant liquid and this one is from Pro Studio it's a heat guard and basically spray all over your hair I've used tiny little headbands that are like these they're sort of see-through and black they're really rubbery so right now I'll be doing two of the remaining plaits here And here we are. So you want to have your plaits quite tight because it will create just like a better effect. But you want to try making your plait as low as possible. And this actually looks really cool. I might actually leave a like this. <laughs> so what we're going to do now is we're going to use some hairspray. I'm going to be using V05 Thin Hold, which is really nice. I'm going to be spraying all over my plaits just to give them sort of more, I don't know, strength, if you know what I mean. You don't have to use hairspray, but I just think it creates better effect at the end. And my nose is going all over my face. For the next step, we'll be using my straighteners. Um, I don't remember where they're from. The heat that I got on is, I'm not going to put it on the highest, but I'm just going to put it on a bit lower than highest because I don't want to burn my hair. I'm also going to be using this foil because it's going to just keep the heat inside the plait and it's going to be much better effect. But I'm going to fold it in few terms and then we're gonna start off um, heating a plait up you don't want to miss any plait so it's better if you separate them I'm just gonna separate a few so I'm gonna start off with three and I'm just gonna put this around probably gonna fold it like this actually so I'm just gonna put my plait inside that's perfect then I'm gonna take this and I'm actually gonna go like that so you want to just heat your plait up you don't have to hold it forever just do a few strokes or a few pats I don't know what they're called all over the plait just like this take it out yeah and it's actually still really hot so hopefully that's gonna work heat on every single plait I'm gonna take these hairbands out and then we're gonna separate our plaits so let's just take these off what I do I just kind of slide them off they're really easy to pull off so now I have all my headbands off what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take each splat and separate it actually I hate this process so much because it takes forever and sometimes my hair is all knotted up but I'm just showing you my first plait and as you can see it's looking kind of good so that's my first plait and as you can see it's already having that effect
So I just unplugged all of my hair and as you can see, this is the result. And I think it looks actually really, really nice. Although it took me about half an hour to unplug all my hair. But it's because my hair is really long and it's just difficult to unplug it. So if you can get help, they get help. So I feel like it still looks really flat. So what you want to do, if you want to make it look more lion-like, is we're gonna pull it back and we're just gonna shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, just like this. And you're gonna have really lionish hair. What we're gonna do now is I'm actually gonna tease my hair a little bit because it looks kind of shitty. So take a few patches and just tease your hair a little bit. I absolutely love this hairstyle because it makes my hair appear really big. Because my hair type is usually really flat, this hairstyle makes it really kind of pop and appear much bigger. That's why I really love this hairstyle. Now I'm going to take a little bit more of this hairspray and I'm just going to carry on spraying. And that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what you think. If you want me to make more hair tutorials, because I don't really make them, like this video. I'll see you soon.